Praise be to God, there is no other God except God. Verse 45, 6 in the Quran says, Which hadith other than God and his revelations do they uphold? Verse 12, 111 says that the Quran is not a fabricated hadith. It details everything. Verse 31, 6 says some people uphold vain hadith to divert others from the path of God. Verses 17, 77, 33, 62, 48, 23, and 6, 114 say that the only sunnah to follow shall be God's sunnah. The Quran informs us that some enemies of the Prophet, described as human and jinn devils, will fabricate lies and attribute them to the Prophet. This is precisely what happened after the Prophet Muhammad's death. Hadith, oral sayings, and sunnah actions were invented and attributed to the Prophet. Hadith and Sunnah are satanic innovations because they, uh, one, defy the divine assertion that the Quran is complete, perfect, fully detailed, and shall be the only source of religious guidance. Uh, two, blaspheme against the Prophet and depict him as a vicious tyrant who did not uphold the Quran. And three, create false doctrines based on superstition, ignorance, and indefensible nonsensical traditions. The Prophet Muhammad was enjoined, in very strong words, from issuing any religious teachings besides the Qur'an. Some so-called Muslims compromise. They say, if a hadith agrees with the Qur'an, we will accept it, and if it contradicts the Qur'an, we will reject it. Such premise proves that these people do not believe God's assertions, that the Qur'an is complete, perfect, and fully detailed. The moment they seek guidance from anything besides the Qur'an, no matter how right it seems, they fall into Satan's trap because they have rejected God's word and set up another God beside God. The Qur'an's mathematical miracle provides mathematical evidence that the Qur'an shall be our only source of religious teachings. Here are just two examples. The phrase, we did not leave anything out of this book, is in verse 38, 19 times 2, and consists of 19 Arabic letters. The phrase, he sent down this book fully detailed, is in verse 114 and consists of 19 Arabic letters.